How would you do in the run and shoot off? <laughs> <laughs> well, I ran it a little bit in uh, in high school, and numbers weren't too bad there. So I guess you know, I know it depends on your system. Uh. <laughs> what do you think about Cole Brennan? I think he's a good quarterback. Um, yeah, I think he's a good quarterback. And runs a good system. <laughs> Let's just go back. I want to defend myself in a comment because on national TV, you guys okay. go, go are pretty good. Go ahead. Uh, which I had no intent in, in knocking Tim Tebow at all. Okay, I had no intent in doing that. What I was doing was defending my quarterback and him not being given the credit for what he's done. My quarterback executes an NFL passing offense, and what you see is a quick release and accuracy, which the great ones have. And, and that is why I said what I said yesterday, not to demean Tim Tebow. we got to go down there and play him. And guess what? They're going to replay that thing like yesterday that I said. When we go open up in Gainesville next year. <laughs> yes, and, they are. And I knew that they were. But that's okay. I wanted to get my point across, and I did. How great is that Hawaii will go to the swamp to open up the season next year? Bob, you heard the back and forth comments. How would Tim Tebow fare running a different system like, say, the run and shoot? Well, first of all, I don't blame June Jones for backing his quarterback, and that's what he should do. At the very end of the season, you're trying to get some votes for your quarterback. June Jones did the right thing. Now, Urban Meyer could come out and just back his quarterback the same way. But let me say this about this whole situation. They're both in the situations that fit them best. Colt Brennan could not run the system that, uh, that Tebow runs, and Tebow could not run the system out there in Hawaii. There's too much throwing and not enough running for Tebow in Hawaii, and not enough throwing and too much running uh, in Florida for Colt Brennan. So they're both in the right system, and... Uh, both coaches are just trying to get more votes for their quarterback. So it's I don't blame like them for standing up. I, so I, it sounds like you think June Jones, has, Jones Jones has a point in what he's saying about Tim Tebow. Well, I, yeah, but Tim Tebow didn't. He was not recruited to go to a, a, a run and shoot style offense. He, he was not going to go to Hawaii. He wanted to go with Urban Meyer, where they're going to run the ball. The guy ran for 22 touchdowns and 29 touchdown passes. Uh, I mean, come on, you got to get, he's a pretty good football player. And we will continue the Team Tebow talk as our Heisman update is presented by Nissan. And this just in, as you heard, Tim Tebow, he's good. He became the first player in FBS history, 20-plus passing TDs and 20-plus rushing TDs. He also set an SEC record and tied the NCAA record for the most rushing touchdowns by a quarterback and set the SEC record, and they've had some players down there, for the most rushing touchdowns by any player at any position. And, oh, by the way, second in the nation and passing efficiency. Oh, by the way, just a true sophomore versus Colt Brennan is a fifth-year senior out in Hawaii. He may get ready to put some hardware on the mantle. And up ahead...